have not posted on this channel in a month hello there people internet welcome to welcome back to my channel my name is jaslyn and if you are new don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video with your friends today i'm going to be doing a very long awaited update video i have not posted on this channel in like a month but in actuality i've just been posting here and there throughout last year 2022 and this year i'm really trying to get back on my youtube grind um i just had a lot of stuff going on this year in 2022 that i just lost track of my channel um so in this video i'm just gonna be going over where i've been what's like coming up in 2023 my goals for 2023 and then what you should expect from my channel moving forward um because i was totally gonna start a brand new channel because I wanted to start like a whole brand new channel because I thought, well, nobody really cares about my channel because I haven't posted consistently in like a year, two years. But I realized that a lot of you guys still watch my videos even if my views aren't like, you know, where they were when I first like was get getting up there in views and subscribers and stuff. But literally my whole college experience and a little bit of my high school experience is on this channel. So I didn't want to just leave it and just be like, oh, well, I'll start a new channel. Like I just want to continue and I know it's going to be hard to grow this channel first starting out because i have been posted on here consistently in a year but i'm trying to just focus on if i can reach one new person or just one person that's in my audience that really works for me i'm trying to work on not comparing myself to other people this year and that being said let's talk about where i've been so um Hello, if you're new to my channel, my name is Jaslyn. I'm a college senior at the University of South Carolina. I graduate in May. Feels really crazy to say that. Um, I've been on YouTube since middle school, honestly, but I was really consistent my sophomore year of college while I was working at Walmart, and that's really how my channel took off, but I have completely pivoted my channel into more of a lifestyle, vlogger type channel. And I am now trying to like get up, trying to get back up there with um, making content and stuff. And I even wrote down a little thing in my little notebook about what I'm going to talk about. So yes, I'm graduating in May, which is very, very exciting. I'm very excited to graduate. Um, that being said, I'm looking for a full-time job for after school after I graduate, which I'm very, very excited for because I really want to do like nine to five, nine to five vlogs, morning routines, things like that. When I get my full-time job, post-grad diaries, just how I'm dealing with life after graduation. And after graduation, I'm moving back in with my mom because I was going to be looking for a house to move in with with my boyfriend once I graduate, but the housing market right now is terrible. Um, I don't want to rent because you're really just paying someone else's mortgage and I don't want to do that. So I'm going to be moving in with my mom. When I'm moving in with my mom, I'm going to be redoing my whole room. Um, I'm going to be redoing my room at my mom's house. So definitely expect some vlogs with that because I'm very excited to get furniture i'm getting a new bed getting a new um nightstand tv stand all that stuff is brand new i'm going to be painting so that is definitely going to be a fun series um when i do move or when i do move in with my mom and i'm also going on a lot of trips this year because of graduation i'm going out of the country with one of my friends for her graduation we're, we're at the same school but she's doing her own graduation um trip and then i am doing one too i'm not sure if it's going to be a cruise or if i'm going to be flying somewhere but i'm getting out of the country okay so that is going to be a vlog as well um i actually started my business 2021 of october and that's been going pretty well um i really took a break in my business too last year just because I was really overwhelmed with school and just doing stuff. I am continuing to work on my business. I was a social media manager, but I scrapped that because I did not like being a social media manager. And now I'm a YouTube coach, which is kind of fitting because I've been doing YouTube since middle school. So it kind of makes sense that I am a YouTube coach. And I'll leave my link down below if anybody's interested in following or if you want to work together, that would be awesome as well. I'll leave that down below. So my goals for my business is I really just want to find new clients for YouTube coaching and I just want to stay consistent with YouTube and my business because I do ultimately want to turn this into my full-time job. I don't want to have a full-time job forever. I do, I've always wanted to be like a content creator, entrepreneur, but this year I'm really like pulling in the reins and really doing what I have to do to get where I want to be because last year was really just me trying to figure figure myself out honestly i went to therapy last year i started working on myself working on my health mental health stuff like that so i really was just occupied with that that i did not really focus on my business or my youtube which is something i'm trying to do this year next another goal i have is 
um, fitness. So last year I was really not caring about my health because I was focused on other things like school and stuff. So this year I'm really, really focusing on my health. That being said, I'm going to be running a 5K on my birthday, my 22nd birthday, April 8th, which never thought I'd say that, but I am in the process of training for a 5K, which is crazy. Like I said, never thought I would be a runner. Um, but I do want to incorporate that into my channel as well because it's my first time ever doing like a competitive type thing, a 5k. And ultimately if I do enjoy the 5k, I'll probably go on to like a 10k half marathon, marathon, maybe. <laughs> so I really want to incorporate that into my channel and just my overall health. I do want to lose weight this year, but I don't want that to be focused on my channel. So really just my health overall is what I'm trying to manage this year. That is a little update about me and my goals for 2023. Now let's talk about what to expect on on this channel so i really want to get back into vlogs i absolutely love doing vlogs um sophomore year i did a little bit last year too but i just really want to just show off my life and i think i was just trying to put myself in a box way too much because i went from like money management to book like booktube type videos i was just all over the place so i am <laughs> branding it in so i'm gonna be doing mostly vlogs lifestyle a little bit of fitness and a little bit of like book type videos like scrambled in here and there like kind of like monthly resets but i add in these type of things so i'm still talking about what i like to talk about but my whole channel isn't surrounded by that so i don't feel like i'm in a box you know what i'm saying so i am very excited for this new start to my channel i think this is what i just needed to do was just sit down and just explain to you what has been going on these past year year or two and like where i see my channel going what i want to do with my channel because i i never wanted to just leave youtube i have been making videos since middle school honestly and i've just always loved the creative process filming editing talking to you guys in the comments and i just really just needed to figure out what i wanted to do and that is what i'm taking 2023 to do is to really just focus on my youtube focus on my business and focus on myself so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are new, make sure to subscribe because I am making new videos as we speak. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.